welcome back to Action Edge. Before we start, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like and share the video. In the quest of a HIV cure, scientists are exploring immune responses that could potentially target and eliminate the reservoir of HIV-infected cells. The kick and kill and the block and lock strategies aim to reduce the reservoir of cells with intact proviral DNA. Yet, a robust immune response is essential to address remaining infectious cells. Unlike most infections, the body struggles to naturally clear HIV due to its ability to evade the immune system. If not for immune responses, diseases like COVID-19 would be as lethal as AIDS. Broadly neutralizing antibodies offer a glimpse of hope. They can neutralize multiple strains of HIV, recruiting other immune responses to suppress the virus even off ART. Studies using VNA abs showcased viral suppression in trial subjects, paving the way for Gillette's Tyson study with teropavimab and senilivrimab, achieving sustained viral control off ART. Viral vector vaccines inducing B lymphocytes in animal studies resulted in long periods of viral suppression, laying groundwork for further research. Antibody resistance and immune responses against foreign antibodies pose challenges. Vaccines aiming to induce diverse B and ABS production show promise but are at early stage. Studies inducing a diverse CD4, CD8 response showcased promising results, highlighting potential avenues in inducing functional cures. Trials incorporating therapeutic vaccines demonstrated the ability to maintain low viral loads in volunteers off ART, showcasing advancements in immune response research. Stay tuned with Actual Edge for the latest advancements in harnessing immune responses towards a HIV cure. Together, we are forging pathways to a world free of HIV. Thank you very much for listening and see you again in the next video. Hello, welcome back to Action Edge. Before we start, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like and share.